Hytale, one of the most anticipated games of this generation. Welcome back guys, Ray here. To recap, in the last video, we were talking about dead Hytale YouTubers, and how different people have come and gone in and out of the Hytale community, before and ever since the big delay back in 2023. Keeping big YouTubers on the side for now, it's time to talk about a few more YouTubers who used to be a glowing part of the Hytale community, but eventually faded. Well, hello, good people. It's your favorite son of Orbis, Mr. Passion here, and welcome back to another episode of Hytale in Minecraft. King Passion, formerly Mr. Passion, was one of the greats of the Hytale community. An artist and master builder, with his unparalleled talent, he can turn any image you give him into a full-on two-scale Minecraft build. Gaia's Temple, the Scaric Outpost, the Earth Circle, Mage Tower, and many other Hytale structures. One of his videos even broke the algorithm once. Moreover, Mr. Passion has collaborated with many names in the Hytale community and is forever one of the OGs of the early Hytale hype train. But since June 27th, 2021, his Hytale content has stopped. Maybe his Discord is still active, I don't know, the link expired. But anyways, when will the legendary King of Orbis, King Passion, return to the Hytale circle? Who knows? We'll just have to wait and see. It's been about a year since I've actually like made a video on this game. And listen, I I've had valid reasons I kind of became a Minecraft YouTuber. However, I still get asked the question, where, where the heck is, is Hytale? Hytale? Red Dunes, also known as Swagger Salt, uh, wait, no wait, was also a very big name in the Hytale community. Literally the co-host of Creatathon himself. Wait, was there even... Wait, who was the co-host? Ah, never mind. He has made videos related to popular Hytale topics and is mainly a gaming YouTuber. Who's still not technically dead, just not in the Hytale circle. He's sticking to mostly Minecraft for now. Since he is still probably active among his fellow big Hytale creators, it's a certainty that he shall be returning to the Hytale circle when it gets rejuvenated. In the year 2525, Hytale has been announced for the fifth time. Hello there guys and welcome back to Jamble. Today we're going to be talking about Hytale and the state that it might be in and our predictions on the game and everything around Hytale because it's been such a long time. I just want to talk about Hytale a little bit. Jamble. Another big Hytale YouTuber who has made his name alongside some of the biggest Hytale YouTubers in the community. He's made videos on a varying amount of topics and has made other videos as well. And the reason for Jamble's disappearance as a YouTuber is getting hit by a 12 wheeler while eating carrots on a sidewalk in Vietnam. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, uh, so yeah, Jamble, m m may you rest in sh shambles. <laughs> Anyways, on to the next YouTuber. Hytale was being delayed until 2023 at least. Now, I wouldn't call this the lowest point in the Hytale community's history, but it ended up startling the whole community. At this point, the Hytale community came to terms with Hytale's release date fate. No bargaining and no theorizing. Now with nothing to cover and nothing to theorize about, the Hytale community didn't lose hope, but slowly faded. Maximus Jet, or Sleepy Frog, was also one of the avid members of the Hytale content creator space. Wait, 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 I'm not dead. Anyways, Maximus Jet is an eternally deceased, forever gone for good Hytale YouTuber currently residing in heaven. His videos shined in the early Hytale YouTuber space. His videos were even showcased at Hytale Creatathon, a community event in which hundreds of people got to see his videos. 
Max has made videos on a multitude of subjects and is also a friend of mine. But since the delay, as everyone's ability and morale for content creation was dwindling down, Max took a break from Hytale as well, and it is of course true that he will be returning to Hytale once it draws near. For now, he has his eyes on other projects, and until then, we can't wait for him to jump back into the Hytale train. Hey guys, it's Splits, and I know it's been a while. The Hytale delay kinda killed all my hype for making Hytale content, but now I'm back with a different kind of video. I'm going to be discussing what my plans are for Hytale when it finally releases, and what type of content I want to do. Blitzstrike, one of the early OGs of the Hytale community, is a big name in the Hytale content creation domain. With videos on many topics, theory videos, as well as discussions with several big creators in the community. And since the delay, he has taken a break from Hytale as well. When Hytale rolls back, his main future plans are to give modding and uh, other creation tools in Hytale a go. As he has always been a fan of modded Minecraft for a long time, he has made videos regarding Hollow Knight Silk Song as well during his leave. So it's pretty much confirmed that he will definitely return to the Hytale space once again. These are merely a handful of examples of dead Hytale YouTubers. The fact that these YouTubers paused their Hytale game really shouldn't be surprising at this point, and we can all hope and pray that all the people who left will return to Hytale as soon as it's rejuvenated, hopefully soon enough. Again, we'll just have to wait and see for ourselves. Anyways, that's it from me. Thank you so much for watching, consider subscribing, Discord and Twitter in the description. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.